Hey guys, this is Press Play Films, and this is my first Let's Play. I'm playing uh, Borderlands, a pre-sequel. Uh, I'm going to be playing as Nisha the Lawbringer. Um, before we get into this, I just want to talk to you guys. There's been a lot of changes to the channel, including the name, plus a lot of different stuff. Um, so, there's another channel now for community stuff, which you guys can actually send me videos to Press Play Films. And if they're good or I like them and I think they're funny, I'll post them on Press Play Films for everyone else to watch. But um, some things are still the same. Like, I still want you guys to tell me what to play and all that kind of stuff. Um, I still want to keep everything the type of way it was. But um, everything is not gaming. There's some stuff that I just think is funny that I have on there, which you guys have probably seen. Uh... But I think that's about it. So let's just get into this. We got Nisha here. Um, I think we're gonna go with this head because I it looks pretty cool. Redemption. And let's get a skin on. Let's go with I don't know. Let's just go with Knight Rider for now. Looks pretty good. Um, I actually put the intro to this game on a separate video, um, because it takes, like, five minutes, and it just doesn't leave very much time to actually record, so if you guys haven't watched that, I'd suggest watching it before you watch this, um, because it gives a whole background to the game kind of thing, so, um, enough wasting time, let's get into this and confirm our character. Oh, she starts with a sniper rifle. I actually haven't played as Nisha before, but yeah, we get um, I get a lot of these loyalty rewards because I played uh, Borderlands One and Borderlands Two. Um, I used to get the doll combat facility, but um, the most thing about this that I like is these two freaking badass weapons here, um, which I also get, and they're. They're really amazing. They actually last for a long time. Which actually, this one's actually a bit different um, from the normal ones I get from it. But uh, I get this shotgun and then this pistol. Which are actually really good weapons for the beginning of the game. Uh, and you guys will see here when I get to actually killing some enemies. Uh, that they'll actually be really easy to take down. You guys just follow this clap trap. Oh no. They sure are. Alright. Yeah, see? Whoops. That wasn't the best example, but... There's so many... Those things that make you... They make you, like, wait for a long time, but yeah, see how it... <laughs> this gun is really overpowered for the beginning, which I think they made it that way. But the skin actually I put on is actually pretty cool. It has like the skull on them. Yeah, this, the shotgun especially is a one-hit kill. Let me show you guys the pistol. The pistol's like just one round and it's good, which I'll take that. But um, yeah. Let me defend the cloud trap. Yeah, I think he's gonna find out that he actually isn't very loved by Jack. The lost legion must have killed this one. People think robots can't feel pain, but we actually feel it in slow motion with great intensity. That'd be this horrible. Oh my god. Yep, I guess Jack wasn't feeling the love like that claptrap was. The bandit who kills bandits. Uh I'm especially looking forward to knowing you better, even just casually first. Oh yeah, I just remembered, um, Nisha is actually, uh, I think 
either his girlfriend or his, I think girlfriend, it might be his ex, but um, that's his ex-girlfriend or girlfriend in Borderlands 2, which I actually plan to play both of them, but I just wanted to start with this one because it was the newest one. Same with uh, Tales from the Borderlands, which I wanted to play that one too. But yeah, just tell me what you guys want to see. Oh, they're really messing up Jack. Your Helios space station now belongs to the oh, there's Zarpanon. Zarpanon, out of all the characters, probably has the weirdest name. I mean, there are some weird names, which you guys will see later. But, um... Yeah, she definitely has a pretty weird name. And they kind of make fun of it, um... A lot through the game, too. But this is a... I'm planning to completely do the series and uh including dlc unless you guys don't like it as much then i'll probably play something else but um so far i enjoy this game i've always really liked the borderlands series um and i think it's like a great twist that they made it on the moon even though there are still all over some glitches that still are in the game but they're nothing really so let's just go over here and revive Jack. Or, uh, oh, there's just a, there are a whole bunch of corpses right in front of him. He's like bending oh over one. You saved my life. Thank you. Yeah. Sorry. Heart's bounding. And we also leveled up. Level two. Oh, as soon as you turn away from him, you can barely hear him. I actually noticed though, he actually has two different colored eyes. One's green, I th I'm not sure. It might just be with the double ganger, but wait, let I me mean, look. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, Jack, I just got all up in your face. Um, but yeah, one eye's green, one eye's blue, which I actually never noticed. All right, looks like you got a shield. And we got our first shield. When it does, you gotta hide and give it time to recharge. Hey, just let me activate the defense controls. A few seconds, we'll have That would be nice, but I have a feeling that that's not going to happen. <laughs> yep. What? How? Jamming signal originates from Elvis. Oh, there's some of the um these look like plans for different things. Yeah, these turns are like nothing. They always bring up, which is really weird, they bring up the thing for the shield like 2 minutes after you get the actual shield. But yeah, you probably, you guys are going to see me using this um, shotgun a lot, especially in the beginning, because it is so overpowered. Um, but I think at least level 5, there starts being some better weapons. Well, I want a Turbo Mansion. Sign me up for one of those. Wow, we are very low on cash. We have 123 bucks. We need to get more moolah. Alright, ooh, there's the escape pods. Oh, son of a tank. Hey, it's that Colonel! Execute plan to shoot that chick in the head! Hello, Jack. Oh, what the heck is that thing? Okay, that's unnerving. Run! Jack actually said my favorite line from this whole oh, game. The, the whole, oh, son of a taint thing. That thing, like, after this mission team? has been, like, stuck in my head. So, you know, uh, <laughs> keep running. Jack, 
What the hell is going on? I'm getting reports of a oh, that's all across Helios. I think he I'm not sure. I I think because I never completed Borderlands One, but um, I plan to. But I remember him from. I think he was in one of the DLCs, if I'm thinking correctly. But um, yeah, he's kind of an asshole. <laughs> Connection, I can, uh, stop. Yep, losing connection, sure. What? Uh, wow, is that part of the moon? Again. Oh yeah, that is, that's the moon. Yeah, I forgot, that's... like, we're on Helio Station? Yeah, Helio Station. Um, but that's the, the moon's actually pretty big, but it's, um, <laughs> the world itself is actually a lot smaller than Pandora, which is one of my things that kind of made me mad, because I thought they could have made the moon a lot bigger than they actually did. Looks like we didn't get the helicopter down, but it doesn't really matter. Her action skill is actually pretty good. It's like using that, um, the thing everyone gets mad at in Call of Duty for, um, I think it's like that one bot thing, aimbot, that's what it's called. That's her, like, kind of skill thing. She goes into a I think the way you upgrade it, she can actually, if you keep on killing things, you get more and more, um, time to actually use the, uh, action skill, which is actually really good. So you can just kind of, if there's a lot of enemies, just sit there and wipe out a whole room with just one action skill. Oh, ammo. Yeah, so we need to pick up some ammo, not especially that for more of the shotgun. <laughs> Whoops. Um, but there we go. Got some ammo and everything. Now I can move on. Got some health. Okay. Well, Alright, let's go. Got a stupid idea. We're gonna head to that moonshot camp. Follow me. Yeah, that's probably not the this best moonshot idea moonshot when somebody says moonshot. they've got a stupid idea. Basically, a huge gun that shoots supplies down to the moon's surface, like at about a thousand miles an hour. We gotta get to the moonshot. That sounds pretty cool. We gotta Looks like. More people? Yeah. Well, that guy just like exploded. But yeah, we up, we up, um, leveled up again. So now we got our showdown. So that's what's called showdown skill. And let's have a look at this. I haven't used it. I've just seen videos about it. But um, it's supposed to be a really cool thing. Let's try this. Oh, that's actually. Yeah, you do increase damage and everything. It isn't very long though. I think you have to get an upgrade to make it um like work longer for with more kills. Is that <laughs> cowardly fixer loader? Yeah, because I think this is actually before all those um upgrades and stuff. So we need to we're gonna end up. Trying to get those upgrades. Ooh, we found a chest. I actually have not found this every time I played it. Let's see if any of these are better. I'm gonna pick them up anyways to sell them, but. Nope. Looks like. <laughs> like I said, the pistol is not gonna. These weapons are not gonna be probably changed to like. Maybe level 5, because there aren't anything as good as these until those later levels. I think this is the first boss right down here. Yep. Be cleansed with heat. Uh, kill that guy, I guess. The weird thing is, he already starts with half of his health gone. Uh, gone. Yeah, we're just gonna take him out really quickly. Flame Knuckle is actually the weakest um, till True Vault Hunter. Uh, he kind of get is more of a challenge, but right now it's just kind of just keep on shooting at him until you yeah dies real quickly. But he drops a lot of money right there, even though they're only like one buck or one dollar. Gotta take care of his. We actually defeated him before the 
me to feel the actual reinforcements. Let's just use this. Oops, I, I always mix up the grenades with the uh the um action skill. For some reason I just hit the I always want to hit the right um button instead of the left for the action skill. I can already see the problem with this elevator. Wow. Wait, what are we doing? I was just like paying attention to the elevator thing. Yeah, he said something, but if you just actually looked at it, you'd see it's a loader. Alright. Do your... Do your typey stuff. Let's get on this thing. Pretty sure this is what I'm getting on, so... Guy. Second largest bullet I've ever on it. Fix <laughs> that, uh, fixture loader is like almost dead. Oh, she has a pretty cool melee. I haven't really. It's like a whip. Did you make it up there? Free up the elevator so I can join you. Yep. So yeah, we're finally at the moonshot cannon, so we can just. No big deal though. They can just. Just bash him out of there. Oh, these there we go. Me out. No wonder Dahl took us over so easily. I need more soldiers. Badasses. Like you. Yeah, I don't mean to, um... But, uh... I'm pretty good. <laughs> Alright, let's get this moonshot going. A crate of Hyperion shall not... Wow, there's just one guy. I, I, I just kind of want to use my action scum. He barely does any damage. There we go. Yeah, this action skill is actually really good for using. You don't have to aim or anything, you just kind of shoot. And the damage is increased and everything. Alright. That kind of stuff doesn't work on me, cowboy. All right, new plan. I'll stay oh, so you can kind of see, yeah, uh, how they're kind of Jack's flirting with her, and she's kind of flirting with him. Uh, kind of show till how later that how they're gonna end up being together. Um, but oh, I just noticed there's these some things over here, bullets. Better heal up before you trip down to the moon. <laughs> yeah, let's, um... Let's just get some ammo. Oh, uh, full health. I always just, like, click that thing four times before I notice that I actually have full... anything. I do that a lot. But... Yeah, let's just get on the moon shot. Come on. There we go. Oh yeah, I forgot Jack has to move all the way down here to get the, um, cannon. We just gotta load up and do it. The thing moves really slowly, though. There we go. Come on. Yay! Oh yeah, I'll make sure not to get my arm chopped off. Well, that's weird. Wait. Well oh. Like hell. It looks kind of like there's no cancer if you move it, like, correct. There we go. So the little part of window there. But um. Your story is making handsome Jack kind of sympathetic. Yeah, Jack is actually kind of a. They show th a lot through this game, kind of how he's a little bit twisted in a way. But he's actually kind of a good-ish guy, if that makes sense the whole game so yeah let's get down to serenity serenity's waste there he is open fire oh crap
Hello? Hello? Okay, so we're on Elphus Pandora's you Moon. Um, and I think okay? I'm gonna end the video yeah, here. Uh, thank you guys all for watching. Uh, leave a like and subscribe. Uh, like I said, I'm glad to be back and getting everything back to normal. I'm gonna post a lot more regularly. I'm not gonna be gone for a while like I was before. But, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. And, uh, episode two will be coming soon. Goodbye.